Good morning everyone. Today we have our 2000 Grady White 248 Voyager. It's powered with a single 250 horsepower OX66 engine. It's a fuel injected two stroke. This, uh, it also comes with a factory hard top and bow pulpit. Fold down swim ladder. Walk through transom door. A little stern shower here, which is nice for rinsing off some bay water if you go swimming. And what's nice is that pier, you can walk, open this door and um, walk right through without stepping, making a big step into the boat if uh, you got some bad knees. All the combing pads are in brand new as of this season. We also have the cushion for this bench seat and the two cockpit seats, but that's it. The deck on this boat, there's no soft spot over the fuel cell, which is pretty normal sometimes in these Grady's or maybe someone's already repaired it. Additional storage here, as well as access to your bilge area. You have your two-stroke oil fill right here, so you don't, you just put a funnel in there, you don't have to go fishing in the, in the bilge of the boat to add oil, which is also a nice little feature that Grady thought about. Twin insulated cooler boxes on both port and starboard. Insulated being the key word. This should be your live well, which it is. Uh, no. Okay, so this would have been an optional live well, but this uh, owner chose not to have one when he got it from the factory. So it doesn't have a live well. And I'm looking to make sure it may not have a raw water wash down either, but which seems unusual, but we'll check for that. Uh, twin helm seats. Here are the cushions, a little bit of staining, but no major rips or tears. Yeah, it doesn't have a, um, doesn't look to have a raw water or a live well. So that's be something you'd have to add. Here's your windless anchor control, hydraulic bent trim tabs, hydraulic steering for the engine, which is also nice. It comes with a Ray Marine A70D fish finder, depth finder, GPS. AM FM radio, nice little light that has a red light uh, as well as it controls your spreader lights. Standard digital gauge. The hour meter on the tack says 809 hours. I'm going to put you down for a quick second to open the Inside the cabin, uh, it also shows well. No major water staining or moldy st smell to it. There is a porta pot in underneath there, and the filler cushion that fills in this area for additional uh, lounging area. We all these this window opens up. Two side windows open up for ventilation on a nice day. This boat does have a fresh water system though, and a little sink right there that you remove the cushion to and you can use it. Um, make sure I didn't forget anything. Twinned uh, windshield wiper blades. Oh, we also, and it's not currently on the boat because it's hot out, have a full canvas enclosure for the hard top. Pretty good shape. Uh, you can still see through it, and the snaps still snap, the zippers still work. All the two-stroke engines are going to smoke a little bit when you first start up and get going, and then it dissipates. It's just burning the oil off the cylinder walls.
Remember to follow us on our YouTube channel that you're watching this video on so for our most up-to-date listings. You can reach Mike Maselli on this listing at 443-324-1368 for additional questions. Thanks for watching, guys. There's our 2000 Grady White 248 Voyager Sea Trial video.